Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back. Um, I'm gonna be talking about something a little bit more serious today. Um, something that actually has affected me and my clan. Well, actually, it, it didn't really affect me, but it affected the people in my clan, uh, which is, you know, which which makes it my problem as well. And it also affected a lot of a lot of people and just you know in the MSL community that were um, that are competitive and stuff like that. And that is. Um, there are, there are hackers in the game like there are there are people hacking and um, some of those hackers were are well, well not are but were in uh, were in Luxuria which is my competitive clan um, I'll tell you guys the story and you know while I do that I'll I guess I'll do some summoning because this way you guys can just watch something in the background while I, while I tell you guys about this um, because I think it's it, it's kind of long, but it's not it's not like extremely long. I'm rambling. Basically, uh, a while ago, our clan split into two. Uh, we had a casual clan called Nvidia and a competitive clan called Luxuria. Um, I stayed behind on the casual clan, and um, basically, I managed that clan. And I have someone, um, a friend of my, uh, managed the clan Luxuria. Um, his name is Night Baron, and he's like the clan leader of Luxuria currently. And um, it's it's a competitive clan, so we basically in Luxuria we only recruit like um, players. I think the requirement is like level forty five and above, and there there are some other requirements and stuff like that. And um, they're basically it's just full of like actual serious people that want to be. Be competitive in like clan v clan and also in like regional defense um and they were pming night baron because a lot of they they noticed that some of the players in luxuria are doing these like insanely high damage to titans and um it was it was just like really really ridiculous um and they were suspecting these players of hacking so as a result um night baron and i went on an investigation we uh we looked at the damage that were that was dealt to to titans by some of these players and um basically we we also got help from from uh asian elite and derp turtle if you guys don't know who who they are they're streamers and they also are in the clan um calm to us calm to us is one of the top clans in the game if not the top clan because if I remember correctly, they were the first ones to beat level 100 titans. They're uh, constantly always number one on whatever map they're on. So they're like, you know, they're like full of whales. Like just, they're the most competitive clan, I think, um, in, currently in the game. And um, they have a lot more experience than us because they know exactly how much damage like a top, top tier team can do to any level of titans. Um, so we got their help to review some of the damage that was dealt to the Titans, and in conclusion, we uh, they concluded that you know it's impossible because even their like like it's they were the 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 hackers were doing like the same amount of damage that like a top top tier whale with like you know like multiple like evil three fire shinobis were doing to like to Titans, and uh, yeah, they, so we. Uh, um, we all got together and uh, basically reported them to 433 for for hacking. And under after a few days of investigation, um, 433 actually you know banned them, so they're 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 gone. Like they haven't logged on for for multiple days, uh, and we're pretty sure that they're they're banned. Um, but hopefully, it's not just temporary because I think you know this is a pretty serious thing, and it actually um, should have serious consequences. Because it's, it's, it like it ruins the integrity of the game, or the competitive competitiveness and in integrity of the game. Because it just, um, you know, for pl other players that are like actually trying hard and, and trying to be competitive, there's no point for them to try if there's no consequences to to people who are cheating. Um, so I, hopefully the the uh, the consequences are severe enough that this doesn't happen again in the future. Um, and I'm just, uh, I'm basically making this video, you know, one to hopefully bring more awareness because I, I hope that 433 actually is like, 
is, is you know is actually strict about stuff like this and at the same time um you know i hope that the community if there's if they anyone like they catch anyone or they, they suspect anyone of hacking um you know they they know that it's, a, it's actually a possibility like there's actually people hacking in the game and it's not their crazy imagination or anything like that um but yeah they're they seem to be gone now so i i think i think that's all right like that's that's all good for now um i won't disclose any names because i don't want i don't want to start like some crazy witch hunt or anything like that like justice is already served by 433 like you know the official justice is already served um so i i, I guess it's it's all right for now we don't have to really do anything um but yesterday there was a I, I was actually waiting for um, a few more days before I go public with this message and that is because we were we were suspecting someone else of also hacking um, in in the clan and yesterday there was a reddit post um, of someone like calling someone out from from the Luxuria clan uh, for hacking in clan versus clan basically what happened was the person had a whole bunch of like evil 3 nat 5s on defense and then the other guy hit him with a whole bunch of like four stars and stuff like that and still won um and it was just it was just really really ridiculous so he basically was just calling him out for hacking and he actually pm'd me i told him that yeah i like this has been uh we, we were we were aware of this and we've been like investigating for the past past um past few weeks like it's, it's been going on for for quite a while um since like since it was brought to my attention and um yeah we just we we don't tolerate hackers like we don't it's just it's it's horrible it just it's, it breaks the game and it it fucks everybody's life up um so yeah that's that's pretty much it um but i wanted to like i was trying to you know not spook anyone and try to try to catch everyone that was hacking um and you guys might be wondering like why there are so many hackers in the clan it was because one of the pe people that were hacking was actually a captain of the clan and uh he was he was responsible for recruiting a lot of the other players as well and we're basically suspecting that the players that he recruited uh, might have also been hacking because you know maybe they like they have like a their own private group or discord or something for like hackers and stuff like that and he might have recruited people um, from that and um, you know we just we're, we're trying to we're trying to purge the the clan of like all the hackers that's what we were trying to do for the, the past little while and um, but now that the cat's out of the bag I just you know I just thought you might as well go public with this and just bring up bring up some awareness because this is also a pretty good chance um, and uh and we're gonna need like more <laughs> real people like more actual not non-hacking -hack competitive people to to join the clan um because we we purged these like these people that were that were hacking um so yeah we're gonna have to recruit more more players for the clans um and and yeah that's that's pretty much it um I have a message from Night Baron to to the community. Um, he wants to apologize or for like just just everything that's 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 happened because it it not only fucked over the people of our clan, it fucked over any clan that was trying to be competitive. And um, basically, like because of these hackers, like Syria stole their spot. So. Uh, it goes, we are truly sorry for the events that have taken place concerning three of our players in the clan. This is the result of one bag egg who is using a modding program to gain an unfair advantage over Titan battles and clan versus clan. We made the mistake of making him an officer, but did not realize he was taking advantage of our competitive clan player base and recruiting even more who used the modding program to our clan. As Fana has stated, after thorough investigation, the modders have been reported and banned. We will remove them from the line lineup at the end of the week and will be looking for new players who are passionate about the game and meet our requirements. 
Hackers will not be tolerated. Death to all hackers. Night Baron. So yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's that's what he has to say, and uh, I completely 100% agree with uh, with his comment. Um, so hopefully, hopefully this is, doesn't happen again in the future. And um, I guess I'll finish up the all the eggs and some of the light dark eggs to to end this video. Still 30 more eggs. I'm just, I'm just like, like I'm almost, it's, it's bad to say this, but I'm almost amused that like, someone's actually hacking in a mobile game. Um, because like, you know, if you, if you ever play like League of Legends, there's like people that are scripting and stuff to try to make it to like a high rank. But like, you know, if you're like in a, in a high rank for like, League of Legends, you might be able to like get more viewers when you're streaming or so something like that. There's like actually tangible benefits to cheating there, but like there's no, there's no tangible benefit to cheating in like a mobile game, like not just MSL, like any mobile game. Like there's no, there's no no benefits to that. Um, besides like, yeah, there's, there's there really is. It's just there's no benefits to. To that besides stroking your own e-boner you know but yeah don't hack don't hack kids don't do drug kids stay in school don't don't do no, none of that mobile game hacking Stay in school, kids. Alright, 20 more eggs. See, I can still I can still make a video talking about a serious subject and be entertaining at the same time. Dang it, my, my inventory is full. I guess I'll feed away the seedlers first. There's not enough room for the seedlers. I can always get more in the future after farming Mirage Ruins. So there's, I guess there's not that much of a point in keeping too many of these. I still actually want at least one light seedler. But if possible, I can if I can get another dark seedler with like a square slot, that would be amazing as well. Alright, we got our first light seedler. Right, he's got one of each, not too bad. Alright, there should be enough room to finish up the rest of the eggs and hopefully hopefully we get something nice. Oh man. Alright. You know, I wasn't counting, but I think I only got like one nat 4 out of like all the eggs. It's alright, you know what? The uh... The more unlucky you are, it just means your, your karma is building up. I also got two light dark eggs, so hopefully, hopefully it gives me something because uh, last week, I actually I got the light dark egg from the bingo, so I was actually pretty lucky. But I, I think I think what happened was I I uh, I didn't get the light dark egg from the from uh, from story farming like from Astromon League or not Astromon League Capture League. Because I was farming golems for like the whole week. 
So where did my second Light Dark A come from? I think it might have might have been from the event. But it might actually be a thing. Like if you if you don't get your light dark egg from Capture League, you might be more likely to get it from Bingo. You know, you never know. I just need my OP light dark luck to come back like it was before. Cause cause in the past, like I would just I would randomly like pop three light dark eggs. And like one out of every three would just be a nat four. That, that's how it used to be. All right, we're gonna have to do one more. We'll just do this. I don't need to keep anything right now because there's not really any like four stars or three stars I'm raising. So I basically can use them all for rebirth, which feels amazing. Ooh, level five lead, Siren. I need a level six lead for my other light Siren, so I, so she can have a perfect lead as well. But it's all right; it's not it's not that important. No, no, no four star here means no, uh, means I'm going to be luckier on these light dark eggs, right? Please, Colt. Yes. All right, I got a Colt. Please, please, no stupid pen pen. Ooh, I just, I just drooled a bit. What the hell? All right, Wolf is, uh, Wolf is better than pen pen. Actually, Wolf's not better than pen pen. I, I'm still going to feed that thing away. Alright, uh, that is pretty much it, uh, just, uh, d moral of the story, don't, don't, don't do drugs, don't hack in mobile games, stay in school, kids, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much it, um, I'll see you guys in the next video, peace out.